space and earth. Indigenous Australians say we are all children of the same mother, Earth. Mother Earth takes care of all her children, providing us with the resources we need to survive. But what do we do? Well, unfortunately, we don't seem to respect our planet. We are causing our blue planet many problems. Did you know that every person in the UK throws away their body weight in rubbish every seven weeks? Now that is a lot of waste paper, plastic bottles and packages. It will be better for the environment if we all recycle. That way there is less need for cutting down trees. The big modern cities we live in suffer from air pollution. We are poisoning the air we breathe and we are to blame for it. But what can we do to help? The future will be better if all the factories use filters on their chimneys. And even better if they stop burning fossil fuels. And the rest of us? Well, we can stop poisoning the air with our car exhaust fumes. Let's cycle or use public transport instead. Another problem is the amount of energy we consume. We need power to run our homes, schools, factories. The problem is that we consume forms of energy that are not renewable. Oil will run out eventually. If we used more renewable resources like wind, wave and solar energy, the planet will be better in the future. Did you know that by turning off the house lights when we don't need them, we save a lot of energy too? We are not just poisoning the air we breathe, but also the water on our planet. In many parts of the world, waste from factories and households end up in lakes, rivers or the seas. This can be really dangerous because we are polluting the water we drink. Local people in some countries of South America depend on the rivers and lakes for fresh drinking water. Quite often, the need for cities to have more roads leads to cutting or burning down trees in order to build them. Deforestation sometimes is necessary, but it usually happens without any planning or respect for the environment. Big parts of forests are cleared away to turn into farmland for a few years. It will be better for the environment if we replant trees. Human activity, however, is not just affecting the natural resources of Earth. It is polluting the air and water that all living creatures use on this planet. Cutting down forests and polluting rivers and lakes is slowly destroying the homes of thousands of wild animals. Many animals are disappearing because they are losing their natural habitats. It seems that we are not showing our Mother Earth the love she deserves. Don't you think it's time we did something about it before it is too late?